Hey everybody, Ace Jen Leem here and welcome to the latest episode of the Pokemon Moon Randomizer Nuzlocke Answer the question of the day which comes from Dylan Which do you think are the most underrated and overrated Pokemon? Overrated, I would say probably Decidueye Because it, it ain't that good kids, alright? It ain't that good And for overrated uh, for underrated, sorry, I would probably say... I really need to go to the PC. I would, um... For overrated... Uh, underrated. I think Sea King's a little underrated. People don't give it as much love as it should, but I will always give Sea King love, because damn Sea King's good. Yeah, I got some bodies to put away. Forgot about that. Alright, where, where are all my dead Pokemon? Right, you're dead. So you need to go in box 8 with Mamakuhita. Uh... You're dead. Can you just remove that Normalium Z? Yup. You're dead, sadly. A starter. And you're dead, and I will take that scope lens, thank you very much. Suppose we have to put some of these garbage Pokemon back into the party. Well, some of them into the party for the first time. Right, let's put Stunfisk in there. Let's put, uh, it's weird that Meowstic has a male Meowstic sprite, look in the bottom right, but it's a female Meowstic, that's really confusing. Uh, ski, I suppose Widow could be helpful. You know what, let's put, let's put a Lolan Gloom in here. And then we still need to go to Brooklet Hill Totem's Den to find a Pokemon. I know a bunch of you have been saying, "Hey Liam, you should go to um, you should go back to Ten Carat Hill because the main open area of Ten Carat Hill, you missed a Pokemon in there." But yeah, but technically, I already um, I already fought a Pokemon in that area, which means I failed the Nuzlocke in that area technically, even without realizing. So I won't go back there, but I haven't faced anything at the Totem's Den in Brooklyn Hill. So let's go that way. I'm gonna have to take Lapras and fly that way. So just remember, nothing I encounter in Brooklet Hill until I get to the Totem's Den is what we're looking for. Ow, that tea is hot. Hello, Fletchinder. I'm not in the mood for you today after yesterday's absolute massacre. Okay, we're doing good though. Oh, I used rock polish and I didn't mean to. Whoopsie. I should probably put a different Pokemon at the front. Yeah, thanks for dropping my attack. It's really helpful. I'm going to knock you out anyway with a rock slide. Come on. Come on, Rocky Slide. If you'd like to suggest a question of the day, by the way, tweet it to me with the hashtag ATLQOTD. Right, let's do this. So, Bish Bash Bosh. Along we go. To the sea. Well, not the sea. To this little bit of river. I should probably put a rappel on or something. Or not. We'll just, we'll just get into battles constantly. We'd better find something good. Oh my lord. Okay, Vika Ball. And I didn't move anybody to the front of the party like I said I was going to do. Okay, let's go ahead and just rock slide this thing to death. Then I'll swap people around. Okay. Vika Ball is down. Good stuff. Let's move someone to the front. Like... Let's get flat down up to speed, because I feel like, even though I don't like Stunfisk, I'm going to be using flat down more than I'm going to be using a Lolan Gloom. A Lolan Gloom. Right, let's go. Gotta make our way to the bottom Brooklet Hill. Gotta cross the water. The water. Let's go. Yay, there we go. I thought we got caught then. I thought we got caught into a battle. So... Here we are, at Brooklet Hill Totem's Den. We are looking for a Pokemon. First thing we find is the first thing we have to catch. And here we go. What's it going to be? Please be something worthwhile. Please, I'm begging you. Uh, I've already got a ghost type, but yeah, sure, Ghastly will do. It's certainly a Pokemon. Right, let's use a Quick Ball. We don't have a Quick Ball, do we? No, let's use a Dive Ball, because we caught it on the water. Ding, ding, ding. Come on, just get in the ball. Just get in the ball. Go on. Please. Please. Yay! We caught a Ghastly. That's now in our party. Wonderful stuff. 
Damn. Gastly's Day will be added to the Pokedex indeed. There it is. And it is... When it tells us... The gas Pokemon, although Ghastly is barely visible, when it's near, its faint, sweet smell lingers. I'm going to call it... Hmm. I'm going to call him Smokem. I don't know why. So I can't even spell it. Smokem. Smokem. Why not? Smoke him, join the party, right? There we go. Well done, Smoke him. Right, now we have to go back to the Pokemon Center. Which is all the way back through Brooklyn Hill. And then we can head towards Vila... We, no, Vila Volcano Park. So that we can do the next trial. Isn't that fantastic, guys? Isn't that fantastic? With our new Ghastly. Boy, oh boy. Right, let's head on up here. I like Brooklyn Hill. It's very scenic. But I also like not having my Pokemon completely massacred. That was something that was very, very disappointing. Keep going, keep going. Oh, bottoms. Ah. Oh, another Vika Volt. How lovely. I mean, I can't do anything with Flat Dam. That's very true. Maybe if we Bide, we could do something. I don't think Biden's going to do much. Oh, actually, you're going to bug bite me? That's good. You can bug bite me again, and I'll do double the damage back. There we go. Flat Dan unleashed his energy. Come on, Flat Dan. Good job. Goodbye, Vikaball. Well done, Flat Dan. Okay. You didn't level up, though, did you? Pile of garbage. Flat pile of garbage that is Flat Dan. Let's keep going. Oh... We really need to push on, and this is not helping. Oh, a Whirlipede. But at least it's training, I suppose. At least it's training. I'm going to go ahead and Bide again. Let's Bide. Bide seems to be doing well with Flat Dan. He's, he's unleashing that energy later on. Poison Stink, don't poison me. Don't poison me. Protect. Oh, that's lame. Okay. Whirlipede's being a bit of garbage. I get it. I get it. But that's great. Unleash your energy. Wow, it did so much damage. I could die. Let's go ahead and use Mud Shark. Because this is poison type, right? So this will be kind of affected. Don't poison me. Oh no, it's neutral. But it did drop your speed. So we'll go for another Mud Shark, shall we? Avoided. Pursuit. Okay. Couldn't have used Pursuit, you know, when I wanted you to. Mud shot. Here we go. Kaboom. One more mud shot will do it. Down goes the speed. Going for pursuit again. That's fine. Jobs are good. So at least, at least flat down will be closer to level 20. But I want to go to a new area. I want to encounter a new Pokemon because damn it, I deserve it after the hell we went through yesterday. There's level 19. Well done, flat down. Uh. Let's do it. Uh, up here. And out here. Oh, do I have to... Oh, no, I don't have to cross the water again. Because there's a bridge this time. So we'll leave Brooklet Hill. Head to the Pokemon Center. Go for a quick do, 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 do. And then onward we go. To the joy that is... Wheeler Volcano Park. I think we have to do the Battle Royal Dome before that, don't we? Just remember when we get to the Battle Royal Dome, that doesn't count as an actual battle. I wonder what our egg's going to be. We still got that egg. We still we still got that egg. Alright, let's go. So we've beaten everybody there is to beat on this route. There's nobody else to face. Well, there is. There's, there's that one other kid that we can't get to yet because we have to go from the north. But we'll go past Paniola Ranch. Oh, hello. You look like you want to fight. How's my egg doing? I just want to check on the egg. The egg doesn't seem close to hatching. Oh my, is this egg ever going to hatch? Watch it be glitched and never hatch. Look at the lustrous heads of my Pokemon. What does that mean? 
Oh, crikey. Bit of loser, mean. Alrighty, let's do this. Them high heels, though. Here we go. Out comes Raikou. Oh, boy. Okay. Well, I suppose if anyone's got a chance, it's Flat Dan with his ground typing. My word. Let's go Mud Shot, please. Okay, he's going to bite. Don't flinch me. Don't flinch me. Here we go. Mud Shot. Drop his speed. Oh, it was a good Mud Shot, though. Are we going to be faster on the next turn and take him out? I hope so. No, he's going to drop my defense, though. That's fine. If you're not attacking, that's okay. And down goes Raikou. Well done. Who's next? Gallade. Holy moly. She means business. All right. I'm going to go bide. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to play it cool. I feel like you'll probably do some physical attacks on me. This will be interesting. Fury Cutter. Okay. Not that great. What else are you going to do? Fury Cutter again. Because that will do more damage this time. Because you've used it in succession. You used Teleport and it failed. Great. Okay. That was a good hit for the bide. Teleport failed. Okay. We're going to go Thundershock this time. Double team. Alright. I see what you're up to. Here we go. Thundershock's going to hit. Bit of damage. Paralysis. That's what we like. Little bit of the old paralysis. And there's the Thundershock again. Still going to hit, even though he's evasive. He's, oh, he's fully paralyzed, but he's not quite taken down just yet. Come on, Thundershock. Avoided. Teleport. Failed. Thundershock. Avoided. Double team. Oh, this could, this could take a while. Get, get comfy, kids. Here we go. Thundershock. Kablamo. He's down, he's down. It's fine. It's no biggie to me, boy. Down he goes. And up we go to level 20. I am going to switch you out for somebody else. There you go, Aether President. Well done. Well done. So who are we switching to the front now? I suppose it'd be my Ghastly. Let's have a look at Smokem's stats, actually, while we're here. Levitate, you've got... Increased defense instead of attack. That's not bad. I'll take that. Nightshade, curse, mean luck, and spite. Lovely stuff. Okay. What about Alolan Gloom? Speed increased instead of defense. Chlorophyll, Stun Spore, Sunny Day, Mega Drain, Sweet Scent. So I could use Sunny Day setups for it. But other than that, it's, it's a garbage Pokemon. Hey, look. We can scare off the Pseudo Wudo. Whoa. Okay, that kid's well impressed. What you got, kid? Strange trees did not attack, but went roaming off towards the Battle Royale Dome. That's cool. Well, the Sudowoodo were off like a flash once they reminded that Z-Power. Thanks, now everyone can use the road again. Here's a little something in return for you. What is it? Mystic Water. Thank you very much. I know what that does. Okay, okay. No biggie, no biggie. Now this is a new route. Route 6. Right, we need to face a trainer. Hello, kid. And then we're going to go get a new Pokemon. When you speak as a youngster, Anthony, I'm the only one in the Alola region. Until someone else called Anthony moves in, I suppose. That's no biggie. Okay, Karate Family Anthony. He's an entire family in himself. Drudigon. Oh, it's way too early for you. It's way too early for you. Please don't have Dragon Rage. Mainly because we've got 36 HP. You should probably switch out, mate. I probably should. Mm, yeah, I really should, actually. No, because then you'll get stuck in a loop, won't you? But you know what? Go for Chandelove, and we'll see what happens. I think Chandelove will be faster than Drudigon, surely. Okay, Home Claws is fine. We're going we're gonna to Will-O-Wisp you, because we're scared of you. Okay. Uh, Will-O-Wisp, please. Oh, my God. You need, you need to get this thing halved. Oh my word, oh my word, okay. Here we go. Will-O-Wisp is on. We're going to confuse Ray, because we're terrified. Uh, confuse Ray. Then we'll Nightshade it to death. Okay, you're lowering my speed, but I'm already slower than you, so that's no big deal. Although it depends what Pokemon comes out after you, I suppose. 
Let's see. Okay, he's confused and he's burned. Now we can start nightshading to our heart's content. Feeling a little bit safer. Okay, he is confused. Scary face. All right. Sip some of that tea because I'm so British. Come on. Not a bad hit. One more of those and he's done. So I need him to either hit himself or be dumb enough to use a status move again. What's your plan? Oh, he went for a status move. You stupid boy. Stupid, stupid Druddigon. Here we go. Nightshade. Druddigon versus Candle. Candle takes him down. Idiot Druddigon. Well done. Hey, level 25 for Chandelure. Well done. Playing it cool. Smokum's level 16. Well done. Who's next? Ooh. Wait, it's an Ash Pikachu. No way. Oh, damn. Okay. Let's go confuse, Ray. Okay, he's going to drop my attack, but I'm not an attacking Pokemon. I'm a special attacker, so that's fine. There you go. And I think we'll just go straight up with the Flame Burst at this point. I think that's going to do more damage. Pikachu is confused. Electro Ball. All right. Oh, but we have been slowed down quite a bit. And Electro Ball is based on speed, right? Doesn't matter. Down he goes. Stupid Pikachu. Oh, that was lucky. That was lucky, was it not? I should probably use a potion or two. I've got some regular potions left. Let's do it. That'll do. That'll do. Alrighty. Now, is there another trainer? Oh, don't, don't miss that super potion, boy. Is there another trainer in this area before I get to the grass? No. Oh, there's that guy. Oh, he got me. <laughs> Whoops. Hi, I'm a breeder. I raise and breed Pokemon. Well, well, that's kind of in the name, isn't it? You do exactly what it says on the tin. Come on. Ace Duo William. Talon Flame. Okie dokie. Kind of concerned. Yeah, maybe I'll just send in Demon Spawn to finish this off because Demon Spawn, I know I can count on. Ever since the day you almost murdered everybody. Okay, Peck won't do much. But I know what will. Little cheeky rock slide. You're going to use agility, that's fine. Again, you're already faster than me, so this doesn't benefit you whatsoever. But down you go! Easy peasy. Goodbye, Talonflame. It's been fun. Smokum's level 17. Well done. Well done, well done. Okay, it's time to go in the grass and get our newest addition to the team, because I'm totally replacing Alolan Gloom with, with whatever we get. You don't know that. It could be something terrible. What's it going to be? Just, just don't talk to me for a minute, all right? Honestly, honestly. Oh, just get in the ball. Come on, okay. Metapod. I mean, in a way, in a way, it's better than having Blossom because I'll evolve it into a Butterfree and it will be more useful, in my opinion, than a Blossom. Unless it calls for help. Can we still count this as an encounter? No, it's help didn't appear, okay. I was gonna say, if it calls for help, it's still technically the same encounter. Could we could we get one of his buddies? Ooh, there's the Harden again. Is he gonna call for help again? Imagine he called for a shiny Metapod. Or a shiny other Pokemon. Oh, that's not much better. That's not much better either. Okay, let's kill that. Bloody Mime Jr. Okay, let's knock out Mime Jr. Okay, it's going to mimic me and use Nightshade. That's not good. We have to take him out. We have to take out Mime Jr. But I think we took off half his HP anyway. So that's that's going to be a no-brainer. There we go. Down goes Mime Jr. 
SOS encounters are a very weird... They're a very weird grey area when it comes to Nuzlocks with the, in terms of the encounter. I would say, in the event that we are in a a battle where a Pokemon is SOS, like, called for help, I think we should... There we go, we got Metapod. I think, like, like let's say that Metapod would have called for a Rhydon. I think we should be allowed to catch the Rhydon. I think that's a thing. Because it's all the same encounter, really. Okay, Metapod's date was added to the Pokedex. It's going in the party, but only because I want to evolve it into a Butterfree. Uh, it's the Cocoon Pokemon. Its shell is hard, but it's still just a bug shell. It's been known to break, so intense battles with it should be avoided. Okay. I'll give it a nickname. Mm. Can I fit in? Oh, I can! Cool. I'm gonna name it after my favorite butter. Country Life. Hashtag not spawn. Country life. There we go. She's great. Add her to the party. Select a Pokemon from my party to get rid of. I'm going to get rid of Alolan Gloom. Sweet. Perfect. So let's move country life to the front. Wait, let's restore that HP. Super potion. Oh, we need more super potions. Damn. And we're going to get country life leveled up real quick. There's a couple of... Oh, there, actually, there's a place we can go this way. Watch us find something amazing now. Second encounter. Eh, not so great. So let's go ahead and switch Pokemon to Flat Dan. Flat Dan can Thunder Shock on Surskit and win. Surskit's cute, though. Sweet Scent, that's absolutely fine. Then we're gonna go ahead and Thundershock. Ooh, quick attack. Okay, that's fine. Thundershock for you, boy. Down you go. You're not gonna be enough to get Metapod leveled up, surely. No. So we still need to work on that. But I remember there being an item through here. Wasn't there? Maybe. There was Sleep Talk. Isn't that fantastic? Just behind the back of a... Behind the back of that hut. That Paniola Ranch house. Right, let's go and face more trainers. Nope, we got a Pokemon to face. I just want to evolve my Metapod, please. Oh, another Surskit? This is lame. Come on, Country Life. You can do this. Let's swap you for Flat Dan. We already know how this battle's going to go. I think we got one more battle to get our Metapod through before we uh, before we get Butterfree. Thundershock, please. Come on. Down you go to the Thundershock. Don't live. Oh, don't call for help either. Oh, God. Oh, good. That could have been a nightmare. That could have been an absolute... Barnstorm of a nightmare. There's the static. You're paralyzed. Doesn't make a difference to us now because we're going to Thundershock you. You're going to go down. And we're going to laugh. Well done, Flat Dan. Well done, Country Life. So I think if we face one trainer on this route. Oh, bollocks. Yep, here we go. You there, trainer. Can you come to my aid? Over here. All right. Yo, 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 don't go and turn in your backside on us. And you, you're that numbskull training from Mele Mele, yo. These scoundrels are Pokemon thieves, and you're on familiar terms with them. Yeah, I know them. Yeah, that's right, you do. I am happy. Okay. Life in the big city sure is something else. Pokemon thieves roam about brazenly. Hmm, I'll leave that one to you. We're not thieves, yo. It's a legitimate business. We go straight. We got straight messed up in Mele Mele. Got exiled to Akala, but we ain't going out like that. <coughs> Come on. Okay, we'll beat this Team Skull Thug, and hopefully that will evolve my Metapod. 
Oh, hello. You look very happy, trial guide grunt. With a Sirsk. Oh, a bloody Sirskit again. Stop having Sirskit. Everybody just give up on Sirskit. Okay, here we go. Bring in Flat Dam. We'll go with the Thundershock. We know what to do. I'm going to use Bubble Beam though. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Not good on the ground type. To be fair. Oh, that's going to drop my speed as well. The problem is, is all of my, pretty much all of my Pokemon that are strong at the moment are weak to water. Okay, Bubble Beam is fine. We can live it. We live in, boys. Down goes our speed. Thundershock, come on. Get a crit, go on. Good lad. I don't know if that was a crit, but it was good. Well done, Day Dan. Country Life's level 15, you know what that means. We beat Trial Guide Grunt, off we go. He's evolving. Finally. Thanks, man. Thanks for evolving. About damn time. Yeah, boy. She's a Butterfree. Well done, Country Life. You want to learn a move? No, nope, Butterfree's data has got to be added to the Pokedex. Well done. So what's next for us? Great, it's the butterfly Pokemon. When attacking other Pokemon, it defends itself by scattering poisonous scales and fluttering its wings. Fantastic. Wants to learn what? Oh, he learned Gust. Okay, that's cool. Well done. Excellent stuff. With all these losses, we're going to anger our bosses. These tears taste like salt, yo. It's all your fault, yo. Yeah, good job, Drifloon. Good job, Mudsdale. Mudsdale, shall we stomp these scoundrels? It'll be a mess to clean up afterwards, but I'm willing if you are. Time for us to break out, yo. Gotta tell y'all peace out, yo. Not gonna keep telling you this, except when I keep telling you this. Better listen to what my homie says and drill into that thick skull of yours. Seriously, you better not forget, numbskull. See you later, Team Skull. Thanks for playing. You'll be fine getting home. I don't have a home. Off he goes, little orphan. Glad to see that one go home on her own. I've got to thank you for that. Give me your name, trainer. Liam, eh? That's a fine name. I like the way you handled yourself in battle. Mudsdale and I are always wandering about Alola trying to achieve our goals, so perhaps we'll meet again someday. I am indebted to you for your aid, after all. Yeah, no. Good stuff. Ah, yes. You might want to try your hand at Battle Royale or two, Liam. Mudsdale here thinks you'd be well suited to it, given how strong you are. Well, if a horse says it, then it must be true. But thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, hit the like button. If you're new, hit the subscribe button. But until next time, I'm Ace Trainer Liam. Keep on training.